Hello people that know, but how is all doing? Today is the same crack as last year, it's this time of year, where they basically hand out awards for freedom of speech and the West Star, promoting freedom of speech in the West Star. And well, lo and behold, five journalists came to me and said, we're going to recommend you. And I was like, God, no, you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. That's where they said there was two for the Irish Independent and there was one from the Irish Times and there was other, other reporters too. I don't know, I can't remember where they were so from. But uh, I was recommended that like, they really admire me for not standing down, especially with the controversy going on with their government, with the government in Brunei at the moment in time, me fighting them, because I'm the only person taking them on head first. And every, that's take, they're taking a lot of notice in that, the five journalists that was done, but, and they really, really liked the way I would not stand down against them. I would not stand down and told them I wouldn't stand down. I told the journalists, they emailed me and I said, I won't stand down to them. And I would never still stand down to them because it's, because people are entitled to their own freedom and their own, to be their own person. And that's as simple as that. And fighting for a better tomorrow, a better island for tomorrow, as one journalist said. Yes, but uh, the way, the way I'm doing this is trying to get people to fight along with me. And they say, look to the government, this needs to be done, this needs to be locked, something needs to be done here, right? We have to work together on this, right? Because that's what I would love to happen in this country. If the government would just listen to the people first. If, if I could make people speak against the government and say, look, this health service is a mess. We have to negotiate with the people of Ireland and try and figure out some way to combat it. You know, that would be, that'd be a terrific thing for the government to do. To, uh, talk to the people and see what the people, what they think they should do in the health service instead of just coming up with some random ideas themselves. Um, so yeah, I would not accept the award in the simplest time. I would not accept any award for freedom of speech or promoting human rights or anything like that. I would not accept any award because the award, the the only award I want is the award for Ireland. An award for Ireland means more to me than means more to me than any award on my chest or any award on my um reputation because I don't do awards. The only thing I do is freedom. That's all I do. The, it's good to know those recommended from five journalists, but, you know, I will meet the person. That's one thing for sure. Because um, they would not make me. Because <laughs> I wouldn't want to mean because I'd give them a debate about how politics should work. But anyway, thank you for watching. And thanks to everybody who probably, I said lots of people probably emailed and were like, look, this fellow deserves it. And they were like, yeah, he probably does. Anyway, thank you for watching. Thanks for um, all the support. And yeah, in the second year in the world, recommend it. Hmm. But I won't join. I won't. I won't accept. Anyway, thank you for watching. Subscribe more.